down here. Shit. Good. Secure an alpha. All right, what's going on, guys? I am bringing you, uh, I guess, what would be the long-awaited Arcaden spawn trap. I've been talking about it for a while, but I just haven't got like the greatest gameplay on it as compared to my other gameplays. You know, when I'm uploading 100 plus kills on mission, I don't really want to upload like a 40 kill game on Arcaden. But this game happened to be flawless, and I got a Moab in it, so I thought, you know, may as well upload it. But I'm gonna tell you right now that this gameplay is gonna be pretty boring, uh, probably even more boring than my mission gameplay, just because of the fact of my spot on this map it is the best spot but i pretty much stand here behind this uh little desk thing or in the desk or whatever and i head glitch different parts of it throughout the entire game you'll see but yeah that's pretty much my spot and i think i heard that guy with dead silence or something anyway but yeah i pretty much stand here the whole time and just wait for them to flood out of that uh door here and i just shoot them and i don't know you'll just you'll see it as the, i'll point out the different spots as the uh game goes on but uh, I just want to talk about how to uh, set up this map a little bit. If you guys want like a full, in-depth like tutorial or whatever, just let me know and I can probably get that done uh, before I leave here to college. So yeah. Uh, also, let me just touch up on that. Um, I'm pretty much recording all these gameplays right now, or er, recording and uh, commentating all my gameplays right now because I don't like commentating over there because the walls are really thin and I don't know. It just seems weird that uh, I would be talking about Call of Duty to myself in my room. If uh, my room, the people next door, you know, heard me, I don't know. But yeah, that's pretty much why I want to do them all right now. But I do, we'll do some over there. Anyway, I just want to say that real quick. So all of these gameplays are me pre-recorded and stuff. So just if uh, something seems off or whatever because of that, that, that will be why. So in this gameplay, if you're coming to my spot, Specialist is a must. And, well, let me go over the, the spawn trap in the beginning, actually. So you're going to spawn A every time if you're host. And... I pretty much spawn, move about six steps, and uh, grab a flag, then move another like five steps, and uh, I'm in my spot. So it's really easy to set up in my spot. And right there, you get all my specialists. Yeah, so it's not too much effort for me to go to my spot, but everybody else has a little more time setting up. You can kind of see on the mini map where they are, but uh, I'll, I'll make a tutorial if you guys want on showing exactly where to look and stuff. But basically, me and my teammate right there, he, he's kind of like a floater. Like on Havana, like there's only five spots, there's a floater, that's what we call it. Um, he kind of just helps out everyone, just moves around, you know, and if I die, it will be a problem because they will all flood out of that door because this is like a main spawn point, so they'll all flood out and uh, it'll ruin the spawn trap, so he helps me out a little bit and in case I die or I'm stunned or something and they come out. So anyway, um, yeah, so you cap A and uh, your teammates go cap B and that's it, they're spawn at C, they'll spawn in the back of C and they'll come through either by the escalators or... Or they'll spawn up here and they'll come up those stairs and they'll come right out this door. And I'm pretty sure actually there's a spawn point inside um, where I'm looking in that door. There is a spawn point in there. But the way we used to watch it, we used to have someone running in there and uh, killing them as well. And forcing them to spawn farther up. Where like they're like literally spawning in front of me. But we kind of had to stop that because of the new spawn points they put in to uh, Domination. And it would flip the spawn. This is one of the few maps left that will not flip the spawns if you uh, try to spawn trap them. So yeah, it's, this this map in Village is probably what we're going to be doing more of now. And Hard Hat as well, but the Hard Hat spawn trap, there's no like best spot or whatever. And everyone on the team gets like 30, 40 kills in. And it's kind of boring to just sit there and spawn trap to get 40 kills. I don't think it's worth it. Um, so well, we don't really play that map. Because, I don't know, sitting in one place and uh, shooting a person every like 40 seconds is kind of boring because the only reason we spawned out mission on dome is because we were killing constantly but on these other maps you kind of have to wait and sit in one spot and uh no one really spawns at your spot for a long time so it's kind of boring but yeah so arcade and village are the only two that we'll probably continue doing and uh yeah so anyway let me just talk about my spot here in case you guys want to try this out or whatever even if you guys don't set up perfectly on the other side this spot will always get its kills no matter what as long as um they don't like come around me to A from all the way around from B, which is really rare that they do that. But as long as they don't come around this spot, you'll get your kills no matter what. And as you can see, I head glitch like right here in between like this little pot thing and the, the ledge or whatever right there. And then sometimes I'll head glitch just the ledge. And I think early in the video, I was like behind the whole table completely. And right here, I ran out of ammo, so I was trying to. I was pretty close to my Moab as well, so I didn't want to die. So I had to go get some ammo real quick. But anyway. Yeah, and then right here, I want to point out that I ran all the way around, as you can see, because 
I was just scared if I had run uh, straight back with my back turned to it that they would have shot me in the back. But anyway, I just want to point that out. Just things like that, you know, help help keep you alive. But right here, yeah, you can see I'm head glitching the back part, and then sometimes I go in the middle, and sometimes you know I'll head glitch the front little thingy, and yeah. This is pretty much all you have to do, but I would definitely say you have to run Flag Jacket because Flag Jacket, wow. You have to run Specialist or run Blast Shield instead of Hardline. And there's my Moab right there. I don't know, I got it to 124, and that's not really a fast Moab or anything, but uh, yeah, you have to run Blast Shield somehow because they will flash you and they will nade you, and that's pretty much the only way you can die. I mean, occasionally you'll get like sniped or something when the guy like creeps out with like Assassin Pro and you can't see him with your Marksman, but. Other than that, yeah, because there'll be like a lot of bodies there piled up, and uh, they gotta like creep through, and he'll end up getting you. But other than that, oh, there's Martyrdom right there. But other than that, yeah, that's pretty much all you gotta do here. I mean, yeah, as I said, this isn't really a really entertaining gameplay or anything. But uh, you guys were asking to see Arcaden, so this is how we do Arcaden. Um, if you guys, I don't know, find a different way, let me know or something. But this seems like the uh, most effective way to me. But yeah, we're kind of just now starting to play Arcane, so I'm sure in, we'll, we'll uh, perfect it now like we did with Mission and find different spots and uh, do different things to it. But as of right now, this is pretty much all we can do. Um, I don't know, just based on the, the new spawn system where they put in, where, I don't know, that update was like a week ago or something, where they said uh, they took away revenge spawns or something. Basically, whatever the spawn system update was that uh, messed up Mission for us, that made it to where they spawn behind us or whatever. That same thing messed up Arcaden to where we can't do that. So, yeah, that's pretty much like I say. That, look at my boy Weezy getting like a quad over there. Anyway, uh, yeah. So I don't really have too much else to say about this gameplay. I just picked up an AK right here. I like the AK, but I don't really like the recoil on it. If I had less recoil, it'd probably be my favorite gun. I don't know. I, it's pretty strong and stuff. So I don't know. And that right there, you gotta watch out for that because they do. Occasionally they'll run out with juice, and I got your RPG me. Yeah. They run out with juice, and they'll as soon as they run out, they'll make a right, and they'll get out of your field of vision, and you got to call that out. And usually the floater guy that I pointed out earlier in the video should be able to get them. But other than that, uh, this spot is really easy. It's probably one of the easiest spots to uh, hold down out of all that I've showed you guys so far. Actually, no, I would say um, left head glitch on mission is probably the easiest. But since you can't do mission and dome anymore. Don't really have to worry about that, do you? But yeah, so this is the new best spot, I guess. I don't know. I don't really have too much to say about this gameplay. As I said, like pretty boring gameplay. Uh, I'm. I just wanted to uh, show you guys since you guys were asking for it. So yeah, so this gameplay is almost over. Just let me know in the comments if you want a tutorial on this or if you don't care or whatever. Just let me know. In the comments what you want I can definitely do a tutorial on this it's pretty easy and uh, yeah guys so that's pretty much the end of the gameplay here uh, I'm not really gonna talk about it. I think the final score was 41 and 0 I got a Moab um, yeah guys that's pretty much it I'm gonna let the rest of the video just play out here and uh, thanks for watching guys and I will see you guys later Hard to explain. Alright, I'm looking at the map. You know the white run storm cloak? Uh, which one? Come on, right next to the white river. Watch. No stone on that one. Next to the ritual stone? Nope. Okay guys, um, click here on the left to see my last video, it was a, um, it was kind of like a joke video making fun of this kid who had 104 days played with like 200,000 deaths, and uh, people didn't really take it the best way, but anyway, if you want to see it, click here on the left, click here on the right to subscribe, um, don't forget to like the video if you liked it, and be sure to follow me on Twitter, link will be in the description, and my next video will be a video talking about how to get a high KD. And it's not going to be the same bullshit video that all the other commentators put out. I'm going to give you some real tips that other people just don't want to tell you or whatever. Maybe they don't do it, but I'm going to give you some real tips on what to do. 
So be sure to look out for that, guys, and I'll see you guys later. Thanks for watching.